Let's go see he and uh Hopefully now this will be a max to her whatever bar there is. A person's ability is measured by the power they display at the point where pressure is applied. Yeah. That's a quote from the baseball famous baseball player Kenji Jojima. I think that he means that you re only really see how strong a person it is when they're under pressure. I wonder how strong I can really be. I wish there was a bar. Let's go to the pool. Swim time. But... Oh, but um, don't stare, okay? Aww. I don't actually have a swimsuit, just a shirt. And when it gets wet, it's kind of embarrassing. Aww, that's so sweet. Uh, I promise I will. Clover my eyes with one arm. Although I wasn't embarrassed before, but now I kinda, kinda am. I wonder how come. Yes! Yes, we've made physical progress! Yes. Went swimming with Hina, who seemed kinda embarrassed. Hina and I grew closer today. Yes. She should like the swimming thing I have. Wait, do I have another one of these? No, it's only zero. Okay, but she should like that, uh... The Water Lover. Co competitive swimsuit for women. Its design and concept is to become one with water. She should like this. <laughs> How thoughtful. This is why I like you, Makoto. Yes! 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 Come on! Come on! I mean, not... Like, 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 not that kind of like. Oh my god. She is too nice. Oh my god. The game's gonna kill her off, isn't she? Isn't they? They're gonna kill her off now. She's too nice. Seeing Hina so pleased with something I gave her makes me kind of happy. Um... Hey, Makoto, can I talk for to you for a sec? What's up? Hmm. Wanted to ask you something. Sure, what is it? Oh, um, I mean, can you just come to my room when when you get a chance? Like, right here, it's like, huh? Okay. okay, see you later. Better not stand me up. Yes! Yes! I've been waiting for this day. Makoto, be happy. Be happy. Without bothering to wait for a response, Hina ran off. What's going on with her? Inviting me into her room like this. See, she's acting really strange. Well, I don't have much choice, do I? I gotta go! Oh, I take off in a dead sprint after her. Oh, hell no. I headed to H Hina's room like she asked. I'm gonna get a drink of water because who knows what's gonna happen. This is gonna be fun. That's a lot of shit in here. Um, sorry for making you have to come here. Oh, it's no problem at all. Oh, I don't mind. What's but what's going on? Um, I just wanted to ask you something. Will you promise to give me a real answer? The real answer is always yes. Well, maybe sometimes. Most of the time, it's always yes. Sure. Well, what do you think about me? I absolutely adore you. You are so, so nice. Uh huh? I mean, me, as a woman. What do I think? What I'm trying to say is... Do I have, you know, womanly charms? Yes. See, the answer's always yes. Yes. Makoto, say yes. For the love of God, I will lend you all of my energy. Just say yes. Well, I mean... Wait, where's all this coming from? No! Don't do it. People have always told me I'm not ladylike. I mean, I can't really disagree. All I'm good at is sports, exercise, physical stuff. But I think maybe there's just because I've never actually been in love. Since I've never fallen in love, how can I say I'm a woman? So that's why, um... um. I want you to be my boyfriend. Yes! 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 Finally! Ultimate victory! Yes! I don't even know who Sayaka is anymore. 
Fuck her. Yes. My life is complete. Someone can kill me now. Oh. No, I mean, not like my real boyfriend, just like a practice run. Well, you know, we need a lot of practice then. Practice run? I'm not a woman because I've never been in love, and I can't fall in love because I'm not a woman. It's like a vicious cycle, you know? Okay. So my strategy is I'll do a practice run to draw out my fe feminine side. That way I'll be in the perfect position to fall in love with me. So I'm asking you, begging you to help me practice and pretend to be my boyfriend. But I mean, seriously, I'm not, I'm not dreaming, am I? I swear to God, if Makoto says he wakes up, I will throw my computer out the window. But... You're the only one I can ask, Makoto. You're my only hope. I mean, how many other guy friends do I have? Oh, no. No, don't say I'm your friend. Don't say I'm your friend. That hurts. No. Please. Please. I'm on hands and knees here. I won't even take that long. Hina seems really serious about this. Fine, I guess I can help. For a little while. <laughs> you mean it? Alright. So what am I supposed to do? <laughs> just Let's just make out for a while. That's how, that's how boyfriend and girlfriend work, right? Uh. Oh, uh, good question. Um... Well, whatever. Let's just get started. Whatever. Okay. Here we go. Um... Oh, darling, you're home. Are you ready for dinner? Or should I get a bath going? Yes and yes. Yes. This is not bad at all. Wait, Hina, that's more like a stereotypical 1950s married couple than anything. Huh? Oh, different approach then? Mm. Well... That's you lied to me? You said you left your wife. What? That's even worse. Huh? Really? No way. You mean, I can't even practice run right? Was that the fatal blow? Seriously, what am I supposed to do? Just become that one crazy lady who gives up on love? Hold on, let's dial it back. First of all, do you really need to go through all this practice stuff? I mean I'll told you, I'm not ladylike. Even if that's true, I'd say that's just part of your charm. Makoto going in for the save! Yes! Pulling it back, it's coming back around! If you push it and get all nervous, that's totally not you, right? Personally, I think you're fine just the way you are, because I mean, that's who you are. Huh? Makoto! And falling in love is supposed to be fun, right? If you stress out about it, where's the fun in that? I mean, not that I know anything about love. Either, uh, so maybe that doesn't mean anything. Um... No, it does. If it's you saying it, it does mean something. Maybe you're right, I shouldn't push it. I should just be me. You got it. I just have to wait until I meet the right person. Like Jason Statham. Statham. Okay. You have a very specific taste. I think you'll be waiting a while on that one. <laughs> anyway, thanks Makoto. You've definitely helped lift the weight off my chest. And on top of that, I kind of had fun practicing with you. We should practice some more often. I might ask you to help me again someday. I would gladly say yes. N no, I think that's enough practice for me. No, no, you get your ass back in that room, Makoto. Yeah. Oh, really? <laughs> then if it wasn't practice, huh? <laughs> Kidding, I'm just jerking you around. A joke, huh? Well, joke or not, I definitely feel like I've gotten a lot closer to Hina. After going through all of this with her, I think I understand her a lot better. I think we've finally become friends in the truest sense of the word. So what's your type, huh? What kind of girls are you into? You're... You are the one! Huh? D don't worry about it. Oh, come on, don't get embarrassed. Haha! <laughs> Hina's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. Uh, achievement as well. Filled every page and Aoi's report card. So I guess I maxed out Aoi Asahina. Yes. That means I don't get to spend time with her though. Darn. But I'm happy. That was, that was fulfilling. I am happy now. That has given me so much hope until they destroy it by killing her off somehow. 
Uh, you just unlocked the skill ambidextrousness. Give yourself a pat on the back, you've earned it. Hina and I got more fired up about love than I expected, and then I went back to my room. We f oh, yeah, we really went in depth on that one. Ha ha! Yes, oh. And there's something by the door. I don't care, I'm so happy right now. Oh, I'm so complete. Oh, that felt so good. Oh my god. That was, oh, that, this is true happiness. True. Oh, I have to read the report card for Aoi Asahina. Now that I've officially starred. Get, look at that gold star. Oh, beautiful. Okay, so you need sugar, humanity. Already read that. She seems really obsessed with her weight these days. She's trying to stick to a diet, but it must be really hard for her. I've never been in love, so my feminine side hasn't awakened. I need to do some practice runs, but after talking to Makoto, I realize maybe that's not the way to do things. Yes! I'm happy. Awesome. That is... That's great. Oh, okay. A little note. Oh, please tell me how Yasahina left me a note to come visit her. Oh, that would be so nice. This piece of paper, it looks like someone must have slipped it under my door. Meet in the dining hall. The handwriting is pretty good. But to want to meet up so suddenly. Who wrote it? And why? What's the point of calling me like, out like this? I'm kind of nervous, but there's no way I can't check it out now. To Aoi Asahina we go. Please be her that left the note. Please. Wait, can I knock on her door though? Wherever she may be. Okay, down the hall corner. She's out of the dining hall. No! No! I want to spend time with Aoi Asahira more! Though I don't think we're going to learn anything new, which is fine. That was, that was good. That was a good bonding we had. Yo. Oh, Makoto! Hero? Then the letter I found in my do room. You know? Yep, I wrote it. I don't want to meet with you! Oh, come on! Your handwriting is really nice. Hmm. Well, I always ta thought that if you had bad penmanship, a ghost would come and haunt you. You're a dumbass. Who taught you that? And why did you want to meet with me? Hmm. Oh, I just did what Kyoko asked me. Wow, you're an idiot. Kyoko? Actually, I'm just an errand boy on this. Hmm. Anyway, what do you say to a late night bath sesh? Huh? You know? Okay, let's do it. N no, I... I was totally lost. Hero grabbed me by the shoulder and pulled me close and whispered into my ear. It's all an act, so the mastermind won't notice everyone's waiting in the bathhouse. What? Then, did Alter Ego finish his search? You got it, hero. Let's go take a dip together. I was probably louder than I needed to be. But me and Hero hurried into the dressing room. God, watch all the girls be bathing, and he just wanted this excuse to spy on him. Yes, my man! Giondo! Hey, you! How long were you gonna keep us waiting? Taka's irritated voice... Irritated voice pierced the air as he started pointingly, pointedly, pointedly at his wrist, wrist watch. It's almost ten o'clock, you know that. Bedtime for all the good little boys and girls. Mm -hmm. Shut up. What? what did you say? You want me to make you cry, little girl? Taka, he seems to be even worse off than I'd heard. Well, maybe it's a good thing. Maybe he's finally started to grow a personality. I like it. What? You got a fat, a lot of poop falling out of that mouth of yours, you know that? How rude, a maggot like you has no right to speak that way to our heaven-sent master. Oh. Are you back to your normal gloomy self? I can hardly keep track at this point. Shut up! Hey, come on. Well, anyway, everyone's here, right? Then my messenger duty is complete. Hey. You wanted us all to meet here, right, Kyoko? So what are you doing here? Isn't it obvious? It's gotta have something to do with Alter Ego, right? That's right? 
Yeah, totally. Did he find a clue? What is it? A way out? The mastermind's true identity? Oh, God. Hina, you're so nice. It's gone. Gone? I came here a little earlier to check out on, check up on things, and that's when I discovered. Alter Ego, the laptop has disappeared. God damn it. What? No way. You're kidding, right? What? She's gone? You. you can't be fudging serious! Why'd you do- What did you do with him? Hmm. What is the- What it, was it the mastermind? Did, did they finally notice what we were up to? Wrong. I told Alter Ego to yell if anyone he didn't recognize appeared. If it was the mastermind, I'm sure he would have alert, alerted us. Well. Maybe we just missed it. I was in the laundry room next door all day. There's no way I wouldn't have heard it. Oh, don't tell me me hanging out with Kyoko equaled us missing that alter ego is gone now. Don't do that to me. But if it wasn't the mastermind, then... The solution to this particular mystery is obvious. It only could only have been him! Mr. Ishimaru, you stole her, didn't you? What? I'm the ultimate moral compass. I would never do something like that. I don't think it counts when you say it about yourself like that. You. You're the suspicious one here. You're, you're nothing but a big jiggling sack of fat. <laughs> Shows what you know. This isn't my true form. I still have three more transformations left. Oh, don't worry. Oh, Kiondo already achieved his final perfect form. Damnation. Wait, I... It wasn't me. Everyone knows you're the thief. Wrong, it's you. Serious. You don't stand a chance against my true power. Well, I'm sure it was one of you. So whoever did it, just hurry up and confess. Wrong. No, there's no way either of them did it. Huh? Uh, why not? I told Alger, Alter Ego to yell if either Taka or Hifumi came into the dressing room. I would yell if he came into the dressing room, to be fair. What? what? <sighs> it was a countermeasure against the clear danger that one of them might come for it. <sighs> but I never heard any yell. Meaning, it's one of us. Indeed. Besides Hifumi and Taka. Exactly, which means it wasn't them. Then who was it? So that's it. The cer fundamental, circumst fundamental circumstances are becoming clear. If it wasn't the mastermind and it wasn't Taka or Hifumi, then quite simply, it was someone else. <laughs> Makoto, Celeste, Sakura, Hino, Toko, or myself. One of us must be the thief. Well, me and uh, Hino were a little busy today. Just a little busy. So, it can't be us. Ha <laughs> ha. And obviously, it's not going to be, uh, Kyoko, as well. Why would any of us want to steal Alter Ego? I was busy with Makoto all day, practicing stuff. How about this for a reason? There's a traitor among us. Huh? Hmm. One of us is working for the Mastermind. A spy. But that's the one who stole Alter Ego. Can you deny the possibility? It, it can't be. I've actually been thinking for some time now that there might actually be a spy among us. Well, if I want to use meta-knowledge with that small scene they showed with him talking to someone. The mastermind brought someone in to keep, help keep things running smoothly. Spy for the mastermind. A traitor. No, it's impossible. Something that horrible. There's, there's no way. Why do you not speak? Are you struck silent by your inability to comprehend such a possibility? I don't care! I don't care who. Someone, anyone, save her. Please rescue her. I'm begging you. I just want to see her smiling face again. Save me here. How many times do they have to kill bro before they're happy? I'll beg, I'll scrap, scrape my head against the ground. Just please give him back. 
I will get in even stronger. He goes into another form. I I would lose my shit. So, um... This is pretty messed up, but still, I think I kind of get how they feel. At the very least. I think Alter Ego is most likely still safe for the moment, at least. If they wanted to destroy it, they wouldn't have taken it. They would have done it right here. I see. So you're saying whoever did this has something else in mind for him. Something else. Damn it. That doesn't matter. Nothing. Nothing else matters. No matter what it takes, I'm going to get him back. That's my promise as a man. I swear I will save her. Using the power of love. Yamada and Kiondo merge together to create an even stronger being. That would be crazy as shit. It's nighttime. It is unfortunate, but we will have to leave the search for tomorrow. From now, everyone gets some sleep. How can you be so casual? We don't have time to wait around. What good are you, are you if you are too tired? You will be much more effective after a good night's sleep. Who gives a crap about effective? We're ta talking about our feelings here! Calm down. Anything we do at night brings a higher chance of the mastermind noticing us. Celeste is right. We should begin our investigation tomorrow morning. What do you think, Makoto? Yeah, I think that's a good idea. I have to go uh, room with uh, Hina tonight anyway, so I'm a little busy tonight as well. You know, for the foreseeable future, I'll be busy. I agree with you. If we run around tonight in a panic, the mastermind's sure to notice, and we won't get anything done. Taka, Hifumi, I know how you feel now, but it's best if just for tonight you can try to endure it. This is fine. Okay, then let us part for today. We will begin our search for Alter Ego in the morning. And you should think about what I said. Someone may very well be spying for the mastermind. Alter Ego. Gone as quickly as he appeared. We'd finally discovered some small measure of hope, but even that was taken away from us, and we couldn't even put up a fight. We were given hope, and that hope was taken away, just like what the mastermind is doing to us. Then could it really be true, whoever stole Alter Ego, could they really be working for the Mastermind? If that's true... No, it can't be! There's no way! I didn't even realize I'd yelled that out loud. The scary thing is, isn't the idea of someone spying on us. What's really scary is, the idea that we're starting to doubt each other again. That scares me more than anything. Damn it! I threw myself into bed trying to shake off all those unsettling thoughts. Before long I fell into a restless sleep, and this weird Monokuma theater appeared. Really rocks my world. Murder is a word whose definition changes with time, with place, with society. If murder is evidence of abnormality, then all of history's greatest heroes must have been abnormal. Yeah, that's kind of true, though. In all honesty. There are a lot of things that get overlooked. But it doesn't make it right. Whether it's overlooked or not. Good but that's just my opinion, of course. Ha, <laughs> I'm no moral compass. Today we have to look for Alter Ego. Okay, first off, let's go to the dining hall. Found myself in surprisingly high spirits and hurried to the dining hall. When I found out what was waiting for there for me. Good god, what is it? Hina's still there, I don't care. Hina was there, I don't care what happens anymore. Is this it? What happened to the others? Aren't they coming? There were only three people in the dining hall. Sakura, Hina, and Kyoko. So including me, only four people? God, this is why I hate people who take their sweet time with everything. However, 
Anyway, let's wait a while, little while longer for the other. So we decided to wait in case anyone else showed up. But no matter how long we waited... Um... So it's 8 o'clock. We've been waiting here a full hour. Why haven't the others come? I mean... Hero and Celeste have never missed a day till now. No! Actually, no. I hated both of them. Good. Please tell me both of them are fucking dead. Please tell me Taka went full up, uh... Kiondo level 2 and just beat the shit out of all of them. And what I'm really worried about is Hifumi and Taka. They were more eager than anyone to look for Alter Ego, and they're not here yet. They could just be, like, out in the school looking for stuff. It can't be. Something must have happened. Huh? It would seem... I was careless. I was too distracted by Alter Ego. But Monokuma gave us a motive. There was no way something wouldn't happen eventually. Monokuma's motive. Ten million dollars. Ten million dollars! Aww. I don't know. I, I still don't think that's a too impressive motive. I this graduation present for whichever lucky student makes it out of here alive. But I mean... What do you think? It's ten million bucks! Ten million smackaroos! It's like totally wowie wow wow, am I right? I mean, I'd still only see Hero killing someone for it. Because everyone else makes a lot of money. Don't tell me someone did something for money. That's what I wanted to say, but I didn't bother. I already understood. I understood, and I hated that I did. You can never really know another person's com person completely. Anything can happen here, and you can't consider it strange. Not really. Hey. We need to go look for the people who never showed up. Hmm. Okay, let's go track them down. And without another word, we left the dining hall. We can cover more ground if we split up. Sakura, go check the door and so make sure to check all of our rooms. Makoto, go check the first floor. Meanwhile, I'll check the second floor. Okay. okay, then I'll guess I'll check the third floor. Anyway. Don't take any risks. If anything happens, call for help right away. But... I really hope nothing happens. No! No, 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 no. Please. Please don't kill her. So do I. Okay, let's go. Anxiety was written across our, each of our faces as we went our separate ways. Without hesitation, I rushed to the first floor of the school. I need to look around the first floor. No, don't kill Hina for fuck's sakes, game. I swear to God.